The aim of the project, Education Innovation, is to bring the School of Business and Economics one step closer to technology-enhanced learning, or what we call PBL 2.0, using virtual reality in the classroom. For a few years now, we are doing research on augmented reality and virtual reality. We constantly look for letting the people immerse in a certain context. How can we motivate them to learn better? That's what we know a lot from uh, entertainment, but also from gaming industry. Uh, people are really immersing in a context. So why don't we learn from such context and also put that into an educational, where the people also should immerse much better than if you just talk about it. The aim of this project specifically was to try to use three different types of applications. What we call the social platforms, which in essence allow you to replicate what you do in Zoom, but on a virtual setting. Then we had what we called the experience apps. The experience apps really taught the students how virtual reality is being used in marketing today and then the simulations app. Students were able to try out how it is like to train to become an air traffic control pilot in VR. Sometimes you go to a hotel room and you see like uh, the hotel room from the inside, for example, uh, but other times we'll just go to a tutorial classroom. You can really interact with your classmates. I felt like I was way more engaged in the tutorial, uh, so the exercises we had to do, um, and also the learning, I felt like it was uh, taken to another level. We're doing quite some research around, especially from a user perspective, when it can be useful and when it can be not useful. So always the positive side and a bit the negative side. Definitely COVID-19 gave us the right push in the direction that we needed. It gave us the perfect environment where students were craving contact with other students and we were able to give it to them thanks to virtual reality.